So tonight's the night. Tonight's my party. Thank you all for coming. So I'm going to do my first ever beauty vlog. And wala pa nakakakita sa akin walang makeup in my entire life. So, eto na. This is it. The reveal. Kahit si Chad, hindi pa to nakita sa akin. Ang bare face ever for 10 years. Tada! Bibilisan ko lang kasi nailang pa ako. Hindi pa ako sanay na walang makeup. So this is me. My natural me. So nag-mask ako. Ilalagay lang natin yung moisturizer na tira sa mask. So ang skin ko, ang pinaka-insecurity ko lang is this. Naman ako kay mami. Medyo ma-under eye. Tama na. Ayaw ko napakita. So let's start. So naka-moisturize na with the mask. With that 24K mask. So... Going for my own, I have to spray this all over my face. This mask it hydrates you, prepares your skin for makeup. Ngayon pa talaga ako ng ng malaking pimple. Ewan ko ba? Not bad naman naman my skin. Okay, there. And then we start with primer. So, ang primer is to really help, you know, para pag binlend ba yung makeup, it glides on smoothly and easily. Don't forget the neck. It's part of your face. There. And then eye cream, you use your ring finger. So I'm all moisturized. So you really, it's really important for you to moisturize your skin, to prep your skin before makeup. So your makeup will glide on smoothly, will stay longer. Para talagang flawless. Next, we do foundation. So you apply all over. What I always tell my clients, and I was a teacher before, my students before, that they have to have a relationship with your makeup. Hindi ko yun nabasa anywhere else. Ako lang niya. You should have a relationship with your makeup. You should know them by heart. Iko compare ko siya kunyari kanino sa boyfriend mo. Kung match kayo, malamig, mainit, hindi siya namawala. foundation dapat hindi masyadong makapal. It should be an extension of your skin. Okay lang yung mga flaws na kita-kita konti. It shows the real you. Now, if you need to reapply, for example, the areas that you need to put more coverage on, then you reapply on that area. Okay na ako dito. Problema ko lang itong pesting under eye ko. So, with my under eyes, what I do, so I use a yellow corrector, this one, to counteract the purplish. Remember that concealer, you blend with your ring finger and then blend up until where it ends. If you guys read my book, I said that concealer should brighten, not lighten or whiten your under eye. Okay, next. Now, I'm going to use my actual color concealer underneath the yellow corrector. So I just dab here, paganya. Kasi you will blend. So don't apply all over. If you apply all over paganon, kakapale. Makeup now are made. Almost all brands are buildable already. Hindi pa ako satisfied. One more. See? My God, what a difference. Concealer is a miracle worker. Like, instant 8 hours of sleep. Kahit na may insomnia ko. At saka, like, now, I know this concealer won't look thick even if I apply, reapply, reapply how many times. There you go. Nice. And then, don't forget this area. May mga iba-ibang style. Whatever style you're comfortable at, go. Huwag niyo kong gayahin. Kung may sinasabi niyo, di naman ganyan. Eh, di go. Gawin niyo ng style niyo. Basta ito, what works for you, works for you. This one works for me. Okay, this is the next. Wala lang. If you just have under eye problems, then you do concealer. Also, if you have blemishes, for example, nagpa-laser ako ng mga aking mga milia, milia dyan, na meron pang marks, then go. You have to cover that with concealer. Kailangan perfect. This is the night. Ah, ayan. Perfect. Diba? Perfect skin with foundation, coverage for concealer, tanggal ng mga imperfections like Julia Barreto. Nakakamali na namin mga tao. Naguguluhan na naman sila kung sino si Julia. Si Julia ang sabi ang, ay, RB? Diba? Diba Julia? Twinny. Ganon. <laughs> Next, so contouring na hindi ako yung typical the, the YouTube Instagram type of contouring. What I do, I don't contour here. I leave this alone. I just do this area. Para lang hindi puting puti yung mukha. Then I blend. At hindi ko siya kino contour in a way na kailangan mukha ka ng kahoy. Magkaroon lang ng, you know, light, dark. Naalala ko nung 190 pounds ako. Nagko-contour ako. Kitang-kita, parang uling na. May nagbura. Binura talaga nung kasama ko. Sabi niya, meron kang dumi. Sabi ko, hindi yan dumi. Contour ko yan. Huwag mong pakailaman niya. So, you know, contour sparingly. Huwag masyadong tibdibin ng contour. There. Ganyan lang. 
Doon lang ako nagko-contour. Para hokis bigas. Parang si Vice Ganda. Now we set. I use an actual color of powder for my middle part of the face, which is the under eye. Manipis lang dapat pag sobrang mukha ka ng powder. Okay. Para may light sa gitna. And then, one tone darker the rest of the face. Ayan. So, yeah. See, para nang glow. Para kung super bait. Parang si Ma'am Charo. Ang makabasag pinggan. Okay, next! Then I contour this area with a contour brush. So, this is my most awaited favorite part. So, ang contour ko. I always do it here. Ewan ko ba? Gusto ko lang na lubog na lubog to parang hindi ka kumakali. And then here again, hollows of the cheek. Mas gusto kasi ang powder kesa sa cream eh. Mas pang Pilipinas for the humidity and everything else. And then the forehead para ma-frame yung face mo. Of course, we want a smaller forehead. Mas soft, mas girl, mas fresh. Malambot. Gusto natin ang malambot. Hindi pang ubar ang contour. Of course, ang pang ubar, pang stage. Hindi natin kailangan yun. Next, everyone's favorite. Nose contouring. I make a V. From that V, I blend up until towards the start of the brow. The smaller the contour, the taller the nose. Mm, original yun. Kung gusto mo mag Michael Jackson, mas maliit. There you go. Kukulang pa. Dapat mag Jodie Santa Maria ito. Yung parang ibon na yung ilong. Perfect! Next! Blush! This is also one of my favorites. Lahat yata favorite ko. So this is one of my favorites. So blush. Ika nga. The more putok the blush, the more beautiful you will be. Apply on the apples first. And then from there you blend towards the hairline. I, I always use two. I use lighter pink for the apples. Tinuro sa akin ni Chris Aquino yan. So, lighter. Beautiful. Fresh. Next. Ito, hindi pa to uso before. Ginagawa ko na to ever. Highlighter. So, there. See? Tama lang glow. Sa Pilipinas, hindi talaga siya pwede. Kasi mukha kang oily. Oily na nga tayo. O oilyhan mo pa. Maganda siya ilagay here. Here. Hate na hate ni Bianca Gonzalez to. Hate na hate to ni Chris. Oh, I don't like shimmer. Remove. Next. I use two shades, one lighter here, and then darker towards the end. There you go. So I'm done with the inner, and then I'll use the darker Blood Sisters. Agatha, Erich Gonzalez. Tada! 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 Erich Gonzalez. Okay, next. Eyeshadow. So eyeshadow for tonight will be just fresh. Konti lang. Again, hollows first, and then blend that area. And when it's blended, see, ibang difference oh, grabe. When it's already blended, then you move out. Ito natutunan ko kay Charo Santos, Concho. Bilugin ang mata. So, you know, it's nice that I learned a lot from my artists, clients. So, nauso ngayon, iba. Before anything else, tinuuna na ay shadow kilay. Style nila yun. Bakit sa'yo last? Walang basaga ng trip. So, okay na yan. Huwag masyadong dark. So, next is the under eye. So, next. Highlighter sa bravo. Highlight this area so that the eyebrows will be emphasized. And also, you kind of cleaning up yung mga lumampas na eyeshadow over here. Para na magkaroon definition ng separation of the eyeshadow here and the highlighter here and the eyebrows there. I also love to highlight the eyelids. Ewan ko ba? Gustong gusto ko to. Nice. Next, eyelining. So you eyeline the waterline, and then curl. Iba, iba ang curling na kapukas. So next is one of my favorites. Hindi mawawala sa list. Kaya ito lang ang makeup na false lashes ka beautiful. Lashes tapa, hindi na nanakot, hindi mo kang gagamba. Diba? Ay, ay, 
Diba? Nakaka-deep set. Ganda. Yan ang lashes. Next, lashes sa ilalim. So, mascara na lang yan. Pwede din kayo maglagay ng false lashes kung gusto nyo. Para fresh. Ito lang. There. See? Tama lang. Next, lipstick. Place me. Ito lang. May trademark. And then finishing. Balikan yung mga kalat-kalat dyan. So, I'm done. Oh my God. Bababa na ako. Tinatawag na ako. Makikita nyo na ako. Ngayon na. Tapos na ang beauty vlogging. Hindi lang kayo na are beautified. Ako din. I are beautified myself. See you guys!